salty snacks and some fruits now. Um, and the cheeses. And some cheeses. We're doing some crazy fruits. We got some guavas here. I've never had any of these, by the way. I've had regular bananas, if that counts for anything. We got some dragon fruit. It's pretty crazy looking, I gotta say. This is a chermoya. I don't even know. It's like a, it's a little heart, maybe. We have a star fruit, um, a red banana. We have dried figs, um, some plantain chips, and then some dates. And then what do you got? Uh, I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> I know we got baby bananas. I don't know what these are called. Those are kumquats. Kumquats. Passion fruit. Passion fruit. And the kawano or kawano. Alright. Alright. It's crazy. Yeah. Alright guys, our food has spontaneously prepared itself perfectly. Um check this stuff out. So inside that green fruit is this well, actually it's orange fruit. It's like green seeds. And then inside that tennis ball looking thing, we have some stuff that looks like larva. It smells incredible though. And then inside the dragon fruit, that pink flower looking thing is like cookie and cream ice cream squares. So I'm excited for this. And this star fruit looks like a star. Okay. So I'm gonna start with the dragon fruit just because it looks pretty sweet. So you can do it at the same time as the other. looking incredible. It has hardly any flavor. Really? It tastes like a kiwi with uh, very little flavor. It has hardly any flavor. It's disappointing. It's... Just kind of mush. No. <laughs> it's not bad though. Much. I mean, if I was hungry, I'd totally eat that. Yeah. Oh, well, first up, what do you rate that one? Uh, it's like one. <laughs> it's a one. Yeah, it was a stupid question. Alright, so, uh, I'm ready to try this passion fruit here. Here we go. Uh, it smells really good. It does. Whoa. That is intense. Really intense, really tangy. Yeah. I don't know if I like it though. I kind of like it. It's got a good flavor. Very strong flavor. The seeds kind of pop when you chew them. It's not bad. Yeah. I'll give it a three. Three. <clears throat> All right. I'm feeling the star fruit. All right. I've heard these are really good. Celery with an apple. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think you ate it. That's exactly what it tastes like. Huh? Kind of flavorless. I'm not digging it. Well, I liked it better than the dragon fruit. So I'll give it a two. I'm gonna give it a one. Um, we're gonna try this uh, guava here. All right, let's do it. Very cut. 
frustrating. It's kind of lucky. That's not bad. Hmm. The red one's better. I don't really know what that flavor is. This looks washed. Like cucumber. Yeah, cucumber. A weird texture. I love how each seed has its own little gel pack. Really weird texture. If I, was, if I was hungry, I would eat. It's a, it's a two. It's a two. All right. Okay. I'm ready to try this, whatever this is. This is a kachar... Chiramoya. Chiramoya. Whoa. Dude, it's incredible. Zero. Juicy. Whoa! <laughs> Very citrusy. Kind of burns my mouth Whoa. a little bit. Oh man. Yeah, biting into that is a totally different experience. Ah, Most that's... overpowered. <laughs> that is terrible. Try it this way. Mm. So sour. <laughs> mm. Alright, yeah. Tastes a lot like an orange. One. <laughs> I'll give it a two. I'll, 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 give it, I'll give it a two. It's not a bad one. Oh man, it's really sour. Alright, what else we got? Some uh, bananas. Let's try this red one. Yeah, let's do some red bananas. Go. So I guess there's a real sweet spot with these red bananas. So it seems here we have a perfect example. It's like a banana. It's a banana. A little bit more tart. A little more custardy. Yeah. Alright. Ready to do the last one? Yeah, I'll leave it in. Ready. First up, what did they get you? Oh, uh, three. Three? Yeah. Seems kind of sweet. A little sweeter than a banana. This is going to be a fork for me. These are good bananas. 
I approve. I'll give it a. I'll give it a four. There's three things left. Alrighty. All right. I'm gonna do some face try to see. Big noon bar. I like it. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty good. I really like big noon bar. Okay. All right. You want to try these eight? Yeah. So, you, what do you give the pigs? Those are good. Those are four. Yeah, four. What was your favorite of, of what you tried so far? This is solid. Yeah, the passion fruit, I think. That's my favorite. This is pretty good. This kind of tastes like black licorice. So, depending on how much you like black licorice. This is kind of nice in that it's kind of like watermelon. Mm -hmm. Not a whole lot of flavor, but nice texture. Mm -hmm. This is like an orange on steroids. Like you just compress the orange flavor and all in just a few bites here. Yeah. This is a uh, cucumber. -y. Yeah. It's very odd fruit. It is a weird fruit. But I'm loving the little seed packets. Like the texture. Yeah. I need it if I was hungry in the wild or something. Like, I would enjoy eating this. Yeah, if I was hungry. Definitely. It's fun to eat. Doesn't taste like much, but it's fun to eat. Alright, well, it's been fun. Alright, uh, now we have some cheese here. Yeah, I'm really excited. I'm pretty pumped. Yeah. Um, where, where do you even want to start, man? We've got mm. cheeses, the no woman cheese that I've heard you're pretty fond of. Oh, yeah. We've cave aged Gruyere. That stuff I can't even pronounce, stuff that looks really gross. I'm pretty stoked. Yeah. You want to just like start in the middle? How about that pesto jack? Yeah, pesto jack. That's all right. Sounds good. Mm. Tastes like. I really like. It. Tastes like a whole sandwich. Mm. Like. Like an Italian dish. Yeah. But just. Just, so, just cheese. Yeah, just cheese. That's a, that's a four for me. Yeah, me too. I like you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm ready for a bite. That's solid. All right. <sighs> what are you feeling? So the uh, cherry, the smoke, the cherry wood smoked cherry.
lap. I believe that's a mild cheddar too. That's good. Smoke is awesome. That would go great with some of that turkey on a sandwich. I can see it. Yeah. Yeah. Subway needs to offer some of these cheeses. Yeah. All right. You rate I thought, that? That's a solid three. Yep, three. How about this habanero jack? It's a habanero being the spiciest or hottest pepper. Ooh, it smells, oh, man. It smells uh, really it's spicy. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. That's good. That's really good. It's like pepper jack with a little bit more tank. Yeah, it's got Got a kick. So the habanero jack, it's like uh, oh, that's a, it's a four. A four? Yeah. Yeah. It's like it's pepper jack with a little more kick, mm -hmm. and then like the sp spice kind of resonates in your mouth. Mm -hmm. I like it. I'll give it a four. Yeah. Okay. What are you feeling? Let's do the let's do the sheep gouda. Let's do it. I like how this one looks like a slice of cheese. It smells uh, goody. Yeah. Whoa. I'm not sure I like that. Oh. It gets all right, but then it gets weirder. More. Uh, it's like a block of parmesan. Yeah. It's got a really weird soapy taste. That I don't like it. One or zero, or why do we do it? That's a, that's that's a one. one. Not, it's not terrible. Yeah. I mean, um, Italian food. Yeah. It tastes a lot like Parmesan cheese, but it's in a block. So it's just really intense. Let's do this Tarentice. 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 <coughs> It's got an alright flavor, I guess. I mean, but yeah. It's like right it's been left in the fridge for too long. No wrapper. Nothing to brag about. No, that's a, that's a zero. I wouldn't purposefully eat that. What about you? Sorry, friend. <coughs> I'll, I'll give it a one. A one? Oh. I mean, it's not off the charts. Stilton with blueberries. Oh, oh blueberry all right. Cheese. It smells really like blueberry. Smells really good. Wow. It's a totally different cheese experience. It's like a dessert cheese. It's like it's like cheesecake. It really is. I like that. I'm gonna give that a three. I'm gonna give it a four. It's like. It's pretty awesome. It's interesting. It's very rich. Alright, how about this poor salut? Apparently made with goat cheese. As opposed to milk. Yeah, goat milk. It's the way that it shatters. It tastes like a baby bill. Baby bill? Baby bill cheese, you know the ones that come wax mm, discs yeah. in it. Tastes kind of like a cream cheese. I like it. I'm going to give that a three. No, four. I'll give it a three. It's not bad. It's not bad. All right. Wood smoked pepper jack looks pretty nice. Let's do it. Smoked pepper jack. I don't know if we get to better than this. My only 
my beef with this cheese. The smoke kind of overrides the pepper yeah, jack. Yeah, it does. It's not very pepper jacky. It just yeah, I wish the flavors were more even. Yeah, yeah. It's a that's a that's a three. Okay. How about this black pepper bella butano? It looks really fancy. It's got this uh, stuff here. Mm -hmm. The real fill of you definitely want to have the side with the pepper on it. about I always forget how much I like that chai beef flavor. It's not very good. I don't know what to think about. It's it's got an alright flavor, but it's just not really it's just not really that great. I get little bits and pieces of things I don't like. <laughs> That's a two for me. I'll give it a one. Uh, alright. How about got two more cheeses? This was like the only flavoring on like a pasta, you know? Yeah, that's a three for me. I like it. That might, that might even be the best cheese. I'll give it a four. Yeah. All right. No woman. This is my favorite cheese that I've ever had, ever. Here we go. Better live up. Oh, wow. sugar in there. There's some jerk seasoning. Oh, man. I love it. That's a five. That's pretty good. Yeah. I'll do it a four. Well. Wow. That was pretty good. Yeah. I do like that still with blueberries. Kind of a dessert cheese. But... As far as sheep cow to goes, Buddha. Uh, it's not good. No. All right, it's been fun. <laughs> and now we're doing salty snacks. Back to you. Just kidding. Okay. So we've got some pretty sweet stuff here. We each have like seven things. Most of it's local, but it is still exotic. 
We have not seen it. I have not seen it. You might have. Do you want to go first? I went first last time. Okay, okay. So these Ritz crackerfuls are crunching chili and cheese. Chili? Not, not heard of that. And that's kind of weird. Cheese, Ritz. Yeah, that's kind of weird for Ritz crackers to do. I haven't seen any look, of that. They don't look like they might. They look kind of good, but they sound kind of gross. They come in another separate package. What is this? This is interesting. Yeah. Yeah. You want to split one? Or are you going to oh, go? Oh, yeah, we, maybe we should split one. Yeah, I don't know how good they might, gonna they be. might be nasty. Who knows? Oh, and there's, there's little ones inside the sub-packaging. It smells chilly. I like the smell. Actually, yeah, it smells pretty easy. I like it. Not bad. Like, that's I've good. Had, I've had chilies that taste worse than this. Yeah. I've, I'm really passionate about it. This is like, I think they aced it. I'm gonna give it five. Mm hmm. That's a five. That's the first five you've given. They're big. Say, and eat these. This is a big moment. I'm gonna open these when the camera's off. And I'm going to eat way more than I should. So, yeah. Yeah. Alright. I got some juice. I mean, I got some candy from Israel. <laughs> I'm pretty stoked. Might be not really candy, but chips, yeah. Wheat snacks. Wheat snacks. Barbecue wheat snacks. In Israel, they must have stronger hands than I do. Because I cannot seem to open it. I would enjoy it. It's kind of like a thing. cinnamon twist when you talk about it. Really burnt. Wow. It's not very good either. It's a. It's very weedy. It's food. I mean, it's not really special. It's really weedy. Barbecue. Barbecue ish. Nope. Sweet. Give was, that a, a one. If I was really bored, I'd eat that. That's a one. Yeah. All right. Wow. Yeah. So this is pretty familiar pizza combos, but it's a classic, classic gas station lifeline here. Yeah. Kind of open those weird. Oh man. All right. I don't know if I've ever had these. No. Yeah. Oh wow. Hmm. Nope. I did have these once. They're still not very good. I kind of like them. Yeah, but like... There's better stuff out there. Yeah. Although... I like the center. Mm -hmm. there more, there's more of a pizza taste than you'd expect. It really tastes tomato -y. Bacon soda, man. Thank you. Oh man, I need all of this. Oh. Wow. It's somehow better than regular bacon. I'm crazy about the texture, the flavor. Gluten free. Really good survival food. It's like ten bags of these in the wilderness, and they'll be good. Really good. Five. Four or five out of five for me. Pretty cool. All right. I'm interested to see these. We 
Oishi prawn crackers. smell like? They smell like prawns. <laughs> they, there's a very oh, wow. organ smell to them. Yeah. I don't like it. Because of the prawn. prawnness of it. It's very prawny. I don't appreciate that. <laughs> Do you like them? They're okay. I'm used to them. I've got a friend. It's all he eats. I'm gonna give that a zero. I'll give it a three. I think they're an acquired taste. Yeah. Alright. How would you feel about pinkin? Pinkin. Ketchup fries. Ketchup fries. In a can. I can those picnic. Picnic. Yeah. Picnic. Basically. There is a second word I said backwards. No good deal. Dyslexia. <laughs> No, I can't, I can't tell where they're where they're made. It seems like knockoff American. No, all this stuff is American except for the smells like the ketchup chips. Let's go inside. Oh man. They're really nasty. I was hoping they'd be a lot crunchier. When they tasted kinda like a cookie. Ruined it, man. Yeah, I don't. I don't dig that very much. <laughs> yeah, no. That, ke <laughs> that ketchup powder stuff is weird. It's yeah. too sweet. It's too sweet. You really just kind of want to eat more, though. <laughs> but they're nasty. Why am I eating more? I know, but like, about five seconds in, you're like, I could go for another one. I could go for another one. But I'm not. I'm done. I'm done with this. Yeah. No, no, no. Just one more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. What do we give that? That's a two. That's a one for me. Yeah, that's terrible. I love the can. All right. Twistos baked snack bites. Asiago flavor. I said that right. <laughs> Crouton to him, it might bring up some bad memories. <laughs> yeah, mm. Certain smoothies and whatnot. That's good. That is pretty good. No. I need these. Mm -hmm. I totally snack on these. Mm -hmm. They seem healthy. Mm -hmm. The color of the back. And that green thing right there? Totally makes it healthy. Healthy. Yeah. No, I'm gonna give that a I'm gonna give that a four. I'll give it a four. Solid. Mm -hmm. Classic American jerky shout. Yeah, it's surprisingly jerky-ish. Mm -hmm. Or coming the little things. Like I bit into it and just put it in half in my mouth and I was like, really? But then like you chew it more. It tastes like pepperoni. It's good. It gets better. Remember, it's, it's the way it shatters that matters. Alright. Oh, you give that. Oh. Three. Um, that's three, yeah. That's three. Alright. Pasta chips, marinara flavor. They're oven baked, they're thin, and they're crispy. That is the, all the descriptions this bag has. Dude, look at all these ingredients. It's like 40. It starts with a word I can't pronounce. Two. Durham Simolina. Sim yeah, let's have some of that. That sounds delicious. That's the main ingredient. Simolina, um, yeah. Wow. Less wow. Not for pride. Still wow. I like it. That is cool. It's a solid four. I'm gonna give that a three. Yeah. Not good stuff. 
I like it. It's good. Are you ready? I'm ready. Flavor bastard. Blasted. Bastard. <laughs> I know. I sound like a Russian person saying <laughs> bastard. Flavor bastard. Flavor bastard. Okay. Bastard in flavor. <laughs> bastard in flavor. You bastard. Okay. Here we go. Queso, fiesta, flavor gold. A fish. cheese party in Spanish. Yeah. Cheese party. I'll give you like the best kind of party. Thank you, sir. A couple. Definitely smells like cheese party. Tastes like a cheese party. Wow. Wow. I like it. I just really like that taco seasoning flavor. That's just my favorite. That is really good. I took four from you. I think they aced it. I'm gonna give it a five. Can't go wrong with goldfish, man. You really can't. Even the ones that kind of taste like hamburgers. Alright. Aaron's. New. All natural. Jalapeno white cheddar. Flavor. Upwar. And it's gluten free. Right. Artificially flavored? Um, probably. But we're just going to keep that on the down low. More cheddar, less jalapeno. Mm -hmm. It's not terrible. Yeah. I feel like after all, eating all those um, strong flavors, it really yeah, it just seems too mediocre. Yeah. It seems. Yeah. Give it a two. 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 All right. I'm ready for Stacy's pita chips. What flavor are they? Parmesan, garlic, and herb. There's a lesson in life. Don't cut away towards your friend. Yeah. All right. Stacy and her pita chips. Oh, oh, a lot of garlic. A lot of crunch. A lot of oven baked flavor. Almost too much. I don't like it. I don't like it. Give it a one. Yeah, one. It's the feds. It's in their cup. Alright. Okay. So, save the best for last. Oh my goodness. Snyder's. Well, last on your side. He's got one. Yeah, the last on my side. Of Hanover's. Their Susan Sourdough Nibblers. The leftovers from pretzels. And what flavor are they? These are honey mustard and onion. Onion? And they were forged by the gods. Feel <laughs> up. Not the best for not the last, mm. but actually the last. <coughs> Here we have pretzel scripts. Pre pretzel scripts? <laughs> They're baked and bold and spicy. 
In deli style. In the jalapeno, jalapeno jack. Jalapeno jack. Oh, yeah. Whoa. What is this? Whoa, that's a very strong <laughs> jalapeno smell. Yeah. There's like a 0.5 second delay on the jalapeno. Mmm. The taste is alright, but the, the jalapeno smell... Jalapeno flavor, yeah. It's not overbearing. But the smell, man. The smell is crazy. It makes me not want to eat it. Which do. nothing should do. So I'm going to give it a two. Yeah. Yeah, two. Back mean. to these Snyders. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Thanks for watching. Uh, rich chili and cheese, super solid. Mm. These, obviously incredible. Oh, what else is really freaking awesome? Less than stellar. Yeah, that, that was not. And most things in a can it's are a mistake. A lot. No, pizza, oh. pizza combos, those are alright. Can't go wrong. I think they're okay. Bacon jerky. Bacon jerky as well. These are the stars of our show. Mm -hmm. we will Thanks for watching. All.